Are you frustrated by this foul team spelling? Let me tell you a little something about it. Because people like to hate on this little guy. Mostly for being inconsistent in how it sounds in words. I'm going to help you understand what happened. Come on. Now come on. Now, we see this foul team in words like head. Great. Speak. And you may have noticed that it frustratingly says three different sounds in each of these words. But English is like old man it didn't always sound the way it does today back in the like 1400s scribes were trying to sort out spellings for words that were being spoken and all three of these words were being pronounced with something like the short e eh sound head gret speck this e eh sound fell somewhere between the long a sound which used to be represented with the letter e still is in most latin based languages and the a ah sound which used to be represented with the letter a still is in most latin based languages so they thought hey a sound that falls between the a sound and the a ah sound let's just spell it e a pretty clever so now we have a nice clear consistent spelling for the e eh sound in all of these words head gret spec good job scribes but then something called the great vowel shift began to happen and words with the e eh sound began to be pronounced with the higher a sound. So gret became great and speck became spake. Head kind of got left behind. It got stuck in the e eh position and never shifted, which is how we also get words like bread, dead, sweat, breast. So now we have great and spake, but then another vowel shift happened where the a sound began to be pronounced with the even higher e sound. So spake became speak, along with a whole host of other words like weak, meat, heat, dream, but great got stuck with the A sound and never shifted along with a few others like break and steak. So before you go thinking that like people in the past were just really stupid about their spelling choices, consider for a second this tendency to assume that like today people are smart and in the past everyone was just dumb. Languages aren't static they change. Pronunciation, in particular, is really fluid. Spellings, however, tend to actually be much more cemented. So the EA spelling didn't change, but the way we pronounced these words did. And now we have three different sounds for this spelling. Whether you find this fascinating or annoying, that's up to you. For more about how to teach spelling in a way that works, hit that follow and check out our foundations class at rootedinlanguage.com.